Hello everybody and welcome to Jurassic World Evolution Mesozoic Metropolis. And I know it has been quite a while since we have been on this series. With the last one we worked on the airport. Was it the airport? Yes it was because the Spinosaurus is being lifted off. Whoops. Oh yeah, I forgot. I Thank God I did deal with that. And today... We are going to be working on which one? I think I said last time I was going to do the mall. Or it was either the mall or the stadium. But for the stadium, I'm not sure what, what I want to do with it. Whether it's going to be like a baseball arena or a football sort of thing. I don't know which one I'm going to do for those yet. But I do know what I'm going to do with the mall. So I guess we can start with the mall. And um... This can actually, well, you can actually change this into a parking space over here. But, well, first of all, we need to um, get rid of um, the sand here. Because it's coarse and rough and irritating. And it gets everywhere. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I, for all you Star Wars fans out there, I apologize. But, yeah, this is coming out, I think, just before May the 4th, which... In case I forget to do a video, no, I am doing a video for that, but may the 4th be with you for when it comes out. So, first we need a hotel, which is going to be pointing this way. And do we want to? I think we need to. Alright, what? No, no. Hold on, I know what I'm forgetting. Give me the path, and let's do a um, normal path for this. Alright, you will go all the way here, and we'll cut a bit of you off in a minute. Or, no, it's fine, it's right there. No, it's way too, it's too close, actually. I'm not going to be able to fit the pool section, because if you didn't know what kind of what kind of mall I'm gonna be basing this off of I'm planning on basing it off of um sort of West Edmonton Mall which I've only been to once and that was like I think in 2019 which oh my god feels like forever ago um yeah so what we're gonna do is we're gonna have like um this like half is gonna be on this side, it's going to be like um, buildings and stuff, all that mall stuff. And then here's going to be sort of like a water zone area. Because you know what, why not? And we need you to go here. And I'm not going to, and I, what dinosaurs are we going to make next, guys? That's the question. Um... Oh my god, how many dinosaurs do we even have made right now? I'm so worried to see. 93, oh my god, 93? Oh, uh, okay, so... Damn, that's a lot more than I was thinking. Yeesh. You know, when we do the final episode where we let them all go into the city, I'm, I'm worried that if I make too many dinosaurs, I'm gonna break the game. Because that's a real possibility, and it actually has happened. Like, um, on my Return to Jurassic World series, um, because it's a campaign, um, it's a campaign set, and it's not, like, just sandbox, it, it counts all of the other islands and stuff. And, um, fun fact, when I was doing my tour video for Isla Sorna, I had to do that five times, because it kept on crashing. Which, oh my god, that was such a pain. Because, like, it was counting every dinosaur that was being, that had been made on all the islands. Which I actually did a count, and it was about t almost 2,000 dinosaurs. Which, for the game, it's not very good. Especially when it um, struggles with um, something like, oh, did it lock? Yes, it did. It struggles with something over 200, which is why I haven't done, like, a re uh, speed build remake of um, the novel version of Jurassic Park. I have done it for, like, Jurassic Park the film, 
and I haven't toured it yet, which I'm planning to do soon. But, you know, it's it's difficult. All right, so are we going to put them this way and then, like, have scenery in the back? And then how far do we have? Okay, yeah, that can work. We can have this changed into a thick, fancy path. And then, yeah, that's what we'll do. We will extend this, um, let's see, one, two, three, four. How's that? Okay, we'll do five because we're going to sort of curve it inwards like this sort of and do different shapes and then you will be changed to no not that one yes you oh dear oops well we'll change that and then no no you go hold on we'll just um We'll do this the proper way. We'll get you. And that's one. Two. And my dog is snoring again, which is, which is fine, but... Oh, well. And there... You no no delete this one. We do not need to delete the road because even though I didn't make a sidewalk walk for you guys, so why are you on the road? I could there could be a Jeep Wrangler Sahara Sand Beige 1992 coming straight across here, and they may not see you because of um the blinding light. Which also guys, I've noticed in my videos that um the especially um when I did the recent battle. Royale, which thank you to all the support for that. It's doing really successful. Um, I noticed something that I was not too happy with, and it was like really um foggy looking. And I realized it's because um I'm doing this on like a separate file. Like, let me explain. So I figured out um for on PS4, you if. I'm recording this on, like, my own file and stuff. I'm not going to show you all the things, but truth be told, this is not my PS4. It's my dad's. And so, because his file's the main one, I, I was playing the campaign on his because I didn't want to lose all my stuff on here because I was just playing it out of boredom. And, well, I discovered it looked so much better on his, and I did a little research... And I discovered it's because um, the main one actually will look clear and other ones will make the games look a little bit more grainy. At least that's what I've discovered. So, yeah. So what I'm doing is um, I'm finishing the campaign on that, like all the campaigns. Like the only one I have to do right now is um, the Claire's Sanctuary one. And then like my upcoming series on the, on this channel, I will be using that file it'll have the same results and stuff but the game but like dress world of evolution will look a lot better in comparison because like yeah when i discovered that i was so annoyed because i was like why do the why does the battle royale look so honestly like garbage which i'm really annoyed with guys like i'm glad that it's getting a lot of um s success but Oh, I wish it wasn't like I I wish it didn't look so bad cuz now I feel so I feel bad for all of you guys when if I had been playing on the other cuz like when I did my return to Jurassic Park playthrough for it's um for a Christmas gift for you guys um I was playing that on my dad's server and at first I didn't really notice that it looked different but then when I went to watch it and then compare it with my return to Jurassic World videos I was like, oh my god, are you serious? Yeah, it was so... That was so not fun to realize. Because that... I could have been giving you way better looking... Ugh, I, I, you asked too much, Austin. You asked too much. Yeah, let's put a tree in here. Why not? 26%? Jesus. This is in the park. It's a city. So we're over the population. We're gonna have to, um... 
Uh, I'm not going to finish that joke because it's not a funny one. It's a bad joke that I saw. Alright. Uh, okay. Wait. What time? Oh my god, we're going to be... Are we... Ser are you serious? We're going to be done this so quick. Um. I just realized this is going to be so quick because like... Unless you guys want me to build the um, parking lot for you guys. Like, the only long part is going to be using the monorail track similar to what I did here, which I cut away for because that took me, like, over an hour. But, like, so far, me building all of this stuff, I I'm almost done, guys. I just have to put the buildings here, trees in the middle, build the um, water park area, which is probably going to be, like, use another hotel and then use some of the um, towers, like... The storm defense, the greenhouse, and then use water, and then, like, put monorail over all of it. After that, it's gonna be done. Oh my god. Why is it s Either this mode is smaller than I was thinking, or... Excuse me, I'm getting faster, which... Doesn't seem right. Alright, so... Clothes shop, you will go... Here, and also, guys. Um, speaking of Star Wars, because I made a May the Fourth joke. Well, May the Fourth joke with you with the sand. Um, I got a curious question. What's your guys' favorite Star Wars movie? Um, cause I was I was actually thinking recently that maybe I would do like a another ranking video because my last one was so successful with um it reaching a thousand views in less than a week which considering my channel's average that's pretty good um I w i'm thinking maybe i could do a ranking video of like all the star wars movies ranked for me would you guys like that because maybe i can do that as like a secondary um s s uh, because i'm doing a star wars tour as well on may the 4th but I also want to let give you guys the option, do you want a ranking video of my Star Wars films? Or do you think no? Like, don't worry for all you Jurassic fans out there, because, well, this is a Jurassic channel. You may be like, well, what about Jurassic World movies? Don't worry, I am planning on doing that. And I'm planning on doing ranking a lot of Jurassic Park rankings soon. But I just wanted to give you guys the option for Star Wars, because, well... May the 4th is right around the corner, which is basically Star Wars Day. And I just want to let you know that I'm thinking about maybe doing a ranking video for it. So, leave in the comments, guys, whether or not you want me to do um, a Star Wars ranking of the movies. Not the shows or stuff, just the movies from episode 1 to episode 9. That does also include, like, Rogue One and Solo. So, just let let me know in the comments, guys, because I, I would love to do that for you guys, because it'd, be real, it'd re be real fun, and I'd love to see your own rankings in the comments below. Alright, now, we will build, well, not build, you can't build a pool, actually, you can build a pool, but you can't build the water. Okay, so I'll put you there. And don't worry, you may be like, Austin, there, there's trees here and stuff. Don't worry, I'm going to put a fence around all of this, except for um, a path right over here, which will be sort of like an entrance area. Like, this is what that'll be. This is sort of like the entrance area. You go this way, go to your hotel rooms, and then you can visit the mall. All right, so let's get sand, let's delete you, and let's let my dog continue to snore peacefully while her head is kind of nearly hanging, which makes me want to give her a stool so she d doesn't because it looks uncomfortable. All right, guys, hold on, I'm going to give her a stool. And we're 
And we're back, guys, after giving my puppy a little stool for her head because I don't want it hanging because, you know, blood to the brain is not very good when it's oh, too much. But also, I realized we need to make some dinosaurs, and I got the perfect idea. We're going to make some herbivores. Well, let's see what herbivores we have first. Okay, we got Penta, we got Edmondinis, Brachiosaurus, and what's that? Dryosaurus? Dryosaurus it is. Alright, so. And also we have Gallimimus and Nasutoceratops over here, and Orano and Nigosaurus. Okay, so I think we'll make two groups of herbivores with um, Homalocephalae being one of them. Um, hmm, what skin, what skin should we have? I want to, well, we're going to do all of them, but I want to do like, eh, yeah, let's just do all of them. So, and we don't really need to modify these guys because unfortunately they cannot fight back against even the small carnivores, which is kind of weird because I know they're s quite small, but it would be, it'd be amazing to see them f fight against something like even a compi, like that would just be cool to see. Oh my god, could you imagine it? Like, Compi tries to attack it. It just literally charges, sends it flying into the air. Oh my god. Awesome. That would be an awesome animation. Just like Compi's like, in his last moments before he's hit, he's gonna be like, What did I- Why am I- I'm an- I'm a- God damn it, I'm dead. Oh, no, no, not yet. We just need to do one of all of you. And then after this herbivore, we will do- Styracosaurus, and um, for carnivore, well, we can also do a Guandon. That's the other one that I was missing. Um, and what carnivore should we do? We're only going to do one carnivore because, like, they're getting packed in there, and I don't want it to get too crazy. Hmm, we'll take a look at the carnivores. Oh, wait, no, we still have a few more skins of you, Miss Homalo. And also, what's your guys' favorite? I just realized something I haven't done that I actually was planning on doing recently um, is ranking of dinosaurs, or like, my favorite skins of dinosaurs. I haven't done that yet. Oh, he is almost done. He's racing. He's racing. I mean, he is a sprinty boy. And the first, Homalocephale. Yeah, like, I'm really starting to see how grainy it looks. God, that's enraging. Like, this looks like sort of like an older game sort of look to it. Like, especially this skin. It looks so foggy. Like, like I'm tempted to even just, like, screen record on um, my dad's file for this game and show the difference of the homalocephaly. Because, like, this is just... Oh my god, I, thank god I'm planning on doing all the campaigns on that, because I'm going to make sure you guys get better quality. After this series, all the videos that'll look like this are tours of like older parks that I've made on this file. After that, um, it's only going to be just for my own entertainment. My dad's file will be for um, YouTube. Because, goddamn, as soon as I found out how, like... Because, like, YouTube recommends that, like, you give your videos, like, one view, view be when you first release it just to get it, like, distributed better. And I do that with, like, a lot of my videos. Like, not all of them, but just some. And when I saw how it looked for the Battle Royale that I recently did, I was so mad. I was like, why does it look so crappy? Like... Everybody's like, God, he's like a little child who can't stop whining. Yes, that's true. Because I'm annoyed. Uh, welcome to Homalocephale. Oh, and also, speaking of um upcoming series, guys. Because we have only three other places to do in this. Which, um, there are these, um, stadium the zoo and the park which these two 
I'm thinking if I c depending on how long this one takes cuz like I'm going to do the zoo first cuz the next one we're going to do stadium, zoo and then park. But if the zoo like is very quick, then I'm going to do the park with it. And then after that it'll be like dinosaurs everywhere, you know, that kind of stuff. But and what what's the Oh, it's these. Well, don't worry, you'll be connected to the path as soon as I make the parking lot off screen. And, um, we'll cut away when I'm bu building the monorail, well, the mall above. Um, yeah. So basically, if you're, oh my god, I just realized that this episode's basically my tantrum episode. It's like... I should I should name it that the mall of tantrums if okay if I don't do that scream at me in the comments guys if I do do that I did good um uh let's go no no come on okay why is it sometimes like they can go over the path like or stuff like there's bits of the tree like um going over here but if it's like too much, it's like, oh no. Like, look at that. There's more of it there than if it's this way. I, I don't know. This thing's weird. And one more, one more. And now let's get the iguanodons. And also first, let's look at what carnivores we do have. Okay, we have T-Rex, Spino, and the raptors. Oh yeah, in case you're wondering, um, I didn't, I forgot to mention this. I had to move all the raptors into their own enclosure because they were done. I lost 12 in here. As soon as I released, um, the Spinosaurus, like before there was only T-Rexes, which was fine. But as soon as I included one Spino, things were going low health, low health, low health, help me. And then I just had to, um, like work to get them out of there. Alright, so what carnivore are we gonna get, then? We could do Giga, because I really love Giga's sounds. Hmm. Or... We could do Sukamimus. Hmm. Now let's get Giga. We already have two of the Spinosaurids already made. We will basically be doing... Oh, excuse me. I'll be basically releasing all types of dinosaurs by the end of this because like you know we want to have as much variety but like for videos I release like one or two dinosaurs all the time that way you guys don't complain that I'm not doing any dinosaurs but we need variety of the carnivores and I love Giga so let's get Giga which has gotten into a giga recently has been in a lot of trouble on like online because unfortunately i don't know who did it and i don't know why they did it i don't care why they did it they were they're stupid but um the design the animatronic for the giga in jurassic world dominion was unfortunately leaked to the public oh my god why why do people do this all right guys we are back at here with the monorail fully completed well the monorail the roof basically i was going originally planning on doing this but i decided to have it open instead i know it's i was i said at the beginning i was referencing um west edmonton mall because it had a water park but i decided to alter this slightly because realistically it would have been difficult to do with um this plus the zip line because you can't have because this is to represent a zip line which is why this is a little higher than this and yeah so here's the inside of the um mall so this is where you like um check up get your reservations in order which you come in from this sort of entrance which just realized i forgot to put the fence around here because it's supposed to be blocked like this is where the parking area is supposed to come. So, like, you come through here, go around here, 
Then you come make your reservations in the bathroom, you know how we always do it. Then once you do, you go over here, oh god, and slam into a wall apparently. You go to hotels, you um, make your, get into your rooms, get all your stuff set up. Then you can come out, go shopping, fossils, toys, arcades, and fast food. And then on the other side is more expensive stuff, which is right outside of the little beach, which has some grass that I might get rid of, and then I'll turn this into either sand or rock. Probably both. And, of course, it's roofed. And this, the greenhouse, if you're wondering what it's for, it's going to sort of represent, like, um, one of those jungle gyms that are at some water parks. This is supposed to represent a, like, tower and stuff that goes to the top of the um, zip line, which if I could put the um, the pole for this closer in, I could make it look like it's connected, but I can't, so oh well. And with that, we are going to have to depart from this, and before we end the video, we need to release, where is it, over here, the Giganotosaurus. Oh, he's running, walking through a baryonyx. Give us the roar. Show your power. Oh my god. I know the design for it that was leaked um, doesn't look like this, which I'm not surprised it doesn't look like this, but I really hope they, like, use some of the roars from Evolution, because, like, I love the Giga's roar in this. Alright, let's release all the others, and then we will do the outro. Oh god, it's getting real loud here, guys. They, they have no idea- actually, yes they do, because they're all over here. They're like, well, we ain't going anywhere near here. Are they panicking? Nope, no, nope, not panicking. So they have no idea what could happen if I open this gate. Ooh, lovely, lovely Giga Boy. What's this skin? Hold on a minute, what's this one? Tundra! Ooh, that is nice! I have not used Tundra. I have used this, this is Wetland, if I am correct. How is it that I've had this game for three years almost? Like, we're almost on the three year mark, and I still don't- haven't used all the skins. I- I lost my mind. So you're a Wetland. Oh, you're Taja. Oh, okay then. Then what are you? I thought you were Taja. You, oh, you are Wetland. Oh, I got them mixed up. I would have thought this one would have been, oh well. God, he's got some lovely, lovely skins. Love the Wetland. But guys, oh, and the rainforest. Oh my god, they are going crazy. We gotta get out of here before so you guys can hear me over this. So guys, that is the mall finished. <laughs> mall. Darth Maul. Because we were talking about Star... Oh my god, Jesus, Austin. Your brain goes to random places quicker than a snap of your fingers. See? My brain went quicker. Um... But guys, that is the wrap on the mall. Not mall. Oh, for God. Austin, Jesus, what is wrong with you? Get your head back in Jurassic World and away from Star Wars for the outro, please. I'm begging you. So guys, that's going to have to wrap up this video. In the next one, we are going to be working on the stadium, which... um. I have a request for you. Which one do you think I should do? Should I do a sort of um, football stadium or should I do a um, baseball stadium? I, I would do both, but that would take up too much space and I don't want to cut into these ones too much. But if you've enjoyed um, this um, video, I'd appreciate the like. And if you want to join the hunt, hit the subscribe button. Be safe. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.